Digital services across every industry have fundamentally changed multiple times over the last 40 years. But the foundations of access control have not. And for electric utilities, this is a critical need. Remote access is the foundation for increasing flexibility and reducing costs because the advanced new technologies now being deployed require specialized capabilities that otherwise are not going to be available at the plant, such as DCS expertise or vendor support. Still, some utilities are refusing to allow remote access, fearing cyber and compliance risks. Traditional remote access uses centralized certificate and key stores, making them vulnerable to exfiltration should a compromise occur. The Electric Power Research Institute is collaborating with a number of companies to develop and demonstrate a new, generation-specific, decentralized, hardware-based remote access product that is safe and secure. You probably already have a similar technology, known as Secure Element, in your wallet. They're the new chips in your credit and debit cards. But they only prevent cloning of identities for physical access. In the electric utility world, protecting digital services access control is equally, if not more, important. EPRI is leading research in hardware-based secure remote access using a Typhoon technology that decentralizes decryption and private keys in an unclonable secure element. This unique hardware security solution cannot be hacked. Criminals cannot clone identities remotely, anonymously, or in bulk. They need the card and the password that the card needs locally and or your biometrics that the card stores locally. The side card destroys itself if cloning is attempted or if the card is dissected. Sidecard not only makes cloning impossible, it also makes awareness of loss immediate. Sidecard already is in use in the financial and transportation sectors. EPRI is working to adapt this technology for use in the utility sector. For utilities, remote users are able to securely access control system networks for scheduled or unscheduled work using the secure Sidecard decentralized key technology. Using their own issued Sidecard, Work supervisors approve access to approved systems and access duration. Individual access is easily provisioned and administered from mobile and administrative applications. Sidecards are issued individually to remote corporate users and vendors for approved access. If a sidecard is lost, it is simply deprovisioned without affecting any other user's plant access. This complete hardware and software solution meets all Level 3 NIST 863 Part 3 Digital Identity Guidelines, the highest level of identity authentication. The Typhoon EPRI solution provides a systematic approach to secure remote access with an additional layer of security. EPRI is demonstrating an architecture that provides for scheduled or unscheduled remote access from the cloud or within the company's network. A dedicated Remote Access Demilitarized Zone DMZ, is used with the solution and provides access to the control network. Provisioning of sidecards can be done on-site and configured to integrate into a company's active directory. Mobile applications are used for system administrator and remote access supervisors. The proof of concept is being evaluated now at EPRI's INC lab in Charlotte. The first phase of this EPRI project, a conceptual design, is complete. A proof of concept report was published in 2016, and a demonstration is now underway in EPRI's Charlotte INC and Cybersecurity Laboratory. Full prototype development is expected to begin this year. EPRI is looking for host sites for field pilots to begin later this year. For more information, contact Jason Hollard 